praise God, praise God, and praise God. I have a um, victory report. And if you would, come on and join along with me. And I want to tell you the story of a, just a couple of days ago, of a prophetic word that I received for my son, Daniel. As you know, um, my faith and my faith, my faith says that, has said that about in the beginning of the year, I begin actually the beginning of the month, that I believe that Daniel is going to be walking at the end of the month. And I feel that. I feel that God is going to cause him to manifest and walk. And so uh, a couple of days ago, today is the, what, 22nd or so, a couple of days ago, I received a prophetic word from someone. And they told me that they, they had to be obedient unto God. And they said that God told them that Daniel, my son, will be walking by the end of this week. And so I'm coming on here to celebrate the word of the Lord, the word that was spoken, and also to agree with the word because the word says that by his stripes we are healed and Daniel is healed based on those 39 licks that Jesus suffered on Calvary over 2,000 years ago. And so through that prophetic word that was spoken, that was said, that by the end of this week, my son will be walking. And I believe it. I agree with it. The Bible also says that where there's two agree as a touching anything that they ask, it shall be done. God's word said it. God said that if you decree a thing, he will hasten to perform it. Uh, and, and it's been decreed. It's been declared. Uh, it's been spoken. It's been touched upon. It's been agreed upon. Uh, the Bible says, how can two walk together except they be in agreement? Uh, our words, according to the word, is in agreement and is walking together. And it shall prosper and it shall happen. And so I just come on here to celebrate uh, God, what he's doing and what he's done. But also I would like to, to say this right here. And I want to pray. I want to pray for I want to pray for just Thanksgiving. I want to pray for Thanksgiving. But God drops up into my word, uh, in my spirit for someone, a word in my spirit to someone. And God said, it might have been broken, but it's not crushed. It might have been broken, but it didn't get to the core. So it was broken, but it can be fixed. Hear me. God says, what something has been broken in your life. What it was broken, but it can be fixed. It's broken, but it's not shattered where it cannot be remade or repaired or reform. So God said it might be broken, but it can be prepared. As a matter of fact, God says that he caused it to become broken, that he can put the pieces back together rightly. See, because it had to be broken because the pieces weren't together rightly. It looked like they were together, but they were not connected together. But God said I had to crush and I had to break certain things out of your life that I might remake it. But for those who just popped on and just hopped on, uh, just to let you know, I received a prophetic word a couple of days ago, two days ago, and the person said that by that by the end of the week, Daniel will be walking. I, I believe it, I decree it, and I agree with it. I agree with that word from the Lord. And so I just come on here to share that with you, that God's miracle working power is real. God is showing his glory and he's revealing his power. There's nothing that God cannot do. If you can learn how to lock in and focus, focus on what is what is it that you want God to, to take place or what, what is it that you want God to, to happen, it can happen. But you must focus and you must trust God lock in the faith and regardless and when there's doubt around ignore doubt and stay locked in and God will cause it to happen. The Bible says, according to your faith. If you have the faith, because the faith belongs to God. When you have faith, you have what God has. You have what God wants you to have that could happen. Because when you have the faith, it says in heaven that it's already so. And when you grab that faith, you're taking what's already so in heaven. And you're making it real before God's people's eyes. Healing is real. Miracles are real. But it's according to your faith. Be it done unto you. Amen. God bless you.